double congratulations for your perfume launch and the mm-hmm. trailer is going to launch. Uh, we have heard that trailer is already been launched at your site. What? Okay. Oh, okay. Sorry. Hmm. So tell us something about the trailer. Oh, well, yes. Uh, today I'm here to launch my perfume, and before I do so, I would like to share something, and that is that we all live two lives. The first life we live is when we think life is permanent, and the second life we start living when we wake up and realize life is not permanent. I recently had that wake-up call when I just lost my father, my strong and healthy father. his electrifying personality transformed into ashes within a second made me realize that life is very short and we might as well wake up and live it and the wake up call did not only uh, you know stop at my dad's passing away i also woke up to the fact that since my teenage years i was trapped in a gas chamber of witchcraft yes and what did that lead me to it led me to loneliness heartbreak lack of intimacy in my life and a wrong projection to the world as though my personality lacked something well now that i realize there's only one life and i'm not going to be here forever i might as well spill out the truth so it was all enforced and why was i punished why was this witchcraft done on to me is rat race so important in one's life that innocent people like me are made victims who are unassuming just to stay ahead in bollywood well to begin with do you even think bollywood is a fair industry here are people who come from the dark dark uh, by lanes of pornography industry of hollywood are treated like royalty and their own homebred girls like me are overlooked do you think i even respect such an industry so how dare you punish me for such a long time into this gas chamber that led me to be single lonely and heartbroken always doubting my own self when there was nothing wrong with me actually there was something wrong with me you want to know what's that i was hotter than you yeah that's right and that's the name of my perfume it's called hotter than you and i'm not here to prove that i'm you know um whatever i'm not here in your dirty game of one upmanship but i'm here to declare to the world of the little life that i have left to live that indeed without any provocation i was punished for so long for no fault of mine other than i was harder than you you were threatened that's what it was so anyway putting all those thoughts aside here is the perfume bottle in the shape of a skull ending an era you know which how they wish last it forever and people ask me pooja what's with your whatsapp status well i woken up after my teenage years and you know what is my whatsapp status read as having sex darling only whatsapp yeah god has made us that way why has god given us a body why has god given us biological needs so that we can fulfill them and just because some arrogant idiot comes along and decides to punish you because he or she is threatened of you you have to suffer and you are harmless i mean i am i am not even hurt a fly so anyway putting an end to that era here is horror than you and uh, the act film i hope you enjoy that and i wish that i could have seen the billboards which were up in juhu but i've been traveling but i'm sure you all might have caught a glimpse of it do write in to me on my website www.horrorthenew.net and moving right along to my movie trailer all right so it's just been uh, the teaser you could say the first look has just been put up on youtube 
and everybody is wondering what is this? Is this a web series? Is it a short film? What is this? Well, I'm very proud to inform you it is my pet project that I've literally been working on for five years. It's a feature film which will have a theatrical release in India and all over the world because uh, it was my dream that when this movie premieres, my father walks in, sits on the front row and sees the film and pats me on my back and finally says, daughter, I'm proud of you. But you know what? I'm denied even that. Even that dream can never come true. So I'm going to make sure the movie does. So um, I just released the first look on the website and uh, I'm getting a lot of feedback. People's curiosity is tickled and peaked and they're like, why didn't you include some scenes of the film, you know, in your teaser or your first look. So uh, all I can say is that just wait till 2019 and it's going to unfold. And yes, for those inquiring, this movie is based on my biography, what's in a name, everything. You were not born to be mediocre. So people ask me, why are you making this film? Why did you write the biography? Because you know what? My second life started. I woke up and I realized I'm not going to live forever. So I want to do things that hold importance that whole gravitas for me and as I said in my interviews earlier that in the past 15 years I've been robbed of 50 movies so you know I can always migrate I can always get married but I'm not gonna do any of that with my head held down Jobi karenge sarutake karenge with pride so this movie is that redemption that freedom that I think I totally deserve and I want the media all my fans all the audience and even my haters to support me in this project because guess what I'm not gonna leave you unacknowledged the way you have left me unacknowledged because I have that much of grace C-L-A-S-S -S? yeah I think so okay other than this, uh, in your movie other than you is there any other artist from Bollywood or from your study who's going to pop out going to act in this movie Absolutely. Three songs of the film have already been recorded and uh, we are just locking the screenplay. Then we are going to get into the casting process which is uh, probably going to be 15 to 20 days where we'll be, uh, you know, filming uh, the reality show Spare Me the Crab Mentality for which we've got an award from the Delhi Education Society because they were thrilled about the fact that we were giving so many work opportunities to freshers as well as to celebrities who are sitting at home after a flash in the pan kind of success because we'll be inviting them as judges on our show. So uh, that will be the process of casting and yes there will be no names in the film who are gracious enough to understand the pain, the agony and the challenge of giving a hardcore performance in a film like this and uh, I look forward uh, to talented actors known as well as fresh ones to come forward and be a part of my film because as my production house's tagline goes I'm here cracking the crab mentality and I'm giving an open invitation to one and all to be a part of my film all you have to do is log on to our website for the reality show which is really quite simple poojamishra.vixsite.com slash reality show and uh, show your interest in being a part of our project. Okay, uh, as, as you have told that uh, you are already getting appreciation from your trailer. So, uh, what is the main USP of your movie so that it can uh, make it different from the other one? I think the main USP of the film is the very fact that it's actually getting made. You would be surprised to know how much of pressure I've been put under not to make this film. I have people walking up to me and saying, you know what, if you change the name of your production house, your content will start selling. You'll start getting financers and funders. So change the name from Pooja Mishra Productions to, uh, you know, Red Stone Productions or something like that. So I'm like, you know, I work so hard. I don't, like I just mentioned, I just ended an era of celibacy so uh, I don't even have a personal life. I drown myself in my work. And what do I work so hard for? To leave behind my footprints in the heart and psyche of my audience. 
And how am I going to leave behind my footprints if my name is not going to be there in the name of my company, which is Pooja Mishra Production, a sole proprietorship. So there's so much of pressure. There's so much of envy. There's so much of insecurity. Oh my God, I might be some goddamn genius. Not that I think so. Please, I'm not immodest, uh, you know, uh, at all. But your uh, uh, feelers and, your, and, and all that you guys do to suppress me make me feel so. So thank you for the compliment. I'm going to strive hard, you know, um, to keep you insecure. Because, you know, um, hatred is easy. Jealousy, you have to earn it. Okay, if you like to give the perfume, uh, anyone from a Bollywood industry who would like to give it? Uh, I'd love to uh, give this perfume to quite a couple of people actually. There are some very lovely people here who I've been following on social media considering I've been jailed up in Pune, uh, which I'd initially gone myself because my dad was sick, but now that he's passed away and no more, I want to ship back to Bombay, which, uh, you know, again, insecurities, pressures, I don't understand this. This is like really quite insane. I might be really, you know, some, some crown jewel to be hidden and gagged so bad. Uh, so coming right back to the point, um, uh, I would love to give my perfume to a lot of people here who've been uh, gracious enough to gesticulate to me on social media about a lot of things in my own life that I'm not aware of. There's uh, Mr. Amitabh Bachchan. Uh, there is Farhan Akhtar, there are a lot of people out there, you know, there's Shah Rukh Khan, there, there are so many people out there, so many ladies also, you know, who've been uh, more than lovely and uh, I would love to send across, uh, uh, you know, a bottle of perfume to your house along with my biography, so uh, do watch out for that, the courier should reach soon. Okay, finally, what would you like to say to the message you would like to give your friends? Well, I would just like to tell my uh, fans that, uh, you know, you all have been there for me and I mention you in every interview of mine, especially during the Big Boss days, you know, when they kept on nominating me and all these viewers, these audience, I'm sure they're just a handful, but they kept on voting for me and they showed me such undying loyalty and mwah, I love you for that. So this is my final trial of fire because this is my first feature film and I want you all to full heartedly support it. Please go on my YouTube channel, Pooja Mishra Original and take the link of the trailer from there and forward it uh, to all your friends in your WhatsApp group, in your Facebook Messenger. Please post it on all your social media handles from uh, Twitter to Instagram to Facebook and uh, show me support in uh, spreading the message uh, about this film, which will indeed have a theatrical release, not only in India, but all over the world, because it is not only an Indian project, it also has international affiliation. Thank you, thank you. Thank you.